am a student at Columbia University. On my campus, over 100 professors have openly advocated for Israel's destruction, justifying the murders of our Jewish sisters and brothers and defending their murderers. I have said this before and I will say it again. I am a black Native American Jewish woman and I will not be silenced. No matter how many anti-Israel demonstrations I must walk past on my way to class, no matter how many of my professors support the students defending Hamas, no matter how many times we are told to cower in fear, I will continue to shout until October 7th. I think my classmates and I had forgotten not only why we love Israel, but why we need Israel. As individuals, we may have many homes. As Jews, we have but one. And I know that many of my peers, faced with so much hatred and anti-Semitism on campus, are feeling helpless and hopeless. But to them, I say, look around you. We are the Jews of the diaspora. This is how we fight. We fight loudly and we fight peacefully. We are far from helpless. We are far from hopeless. Theodore Herzl, founder of Zionism, wrote, whole branches of Judaism may wither and fall, but the trunk remains. We lost a beautiful branch on October 7th, we did. But as I look in front of me now, I see a very sturdy trunk. And it is from this trunk that I know more branches will grow should we will it. Toda rabah.